peace and blessings to them. Here on the mountain where the Creator led me here to pray. Um, as I pray for the nation, as I'm praying for myself, praying for our children, I'm praying for our grandchildren right here. I'm up here on the mountain. And this is where Yahweh led me um, to pray. And I'm giving all the glory to the Most High Yah, asking for deliverance for the nation, uh, deliverance for those who are in captivity. Um, that the Creator will bless you all abundantly um, so that you can get out of the United States of America. I'm right up here on my mountain um, where Yahweh directed me here after I had a spiritual uh, moment with the Most High Yah in the water. I will be going back, headed back to the water um, to finish the recording of spiritualism with Yahweh, the Creator of the heavens, the earth, the seas, and all in them is Yahweh created. See, I'm up in the mountain and I love it. is righteous, Yahweh is holy, and Yahuwah will be glorified. With or without me, you or any of us, Yahweh will be glorified. So, I'm going to give thanks to you. But I'm up on the mountain. I heard a guy here was having prayer. Um, his prayer was in Zadaya. To continue on, uh, to commune with the Most High Yah. Uh, we are in a dire, urgent need for help. And all of our help comes from Yahweh. All of my help comes from Yahweh. So once again, this is Leah. Um, and I'm praying that the classes, um, the camps, the churches will tell people to flee out of Babylon, as Yahweh said, um, to, to fear Yahweh and to deliver every man his own soul. You can't save anyone, let alone yourself. And that's only through your righteousness. And you're not righteous if you're not telling the people to flee. your daddy, your children, your wife, you can't save anyone. You can barely even save yourself only through your righteousness. So you want to be righteous. You don't want to be called the little gods. Uh, you don't want to be eating pork and crabs and fish and eating church. We're going to stay here. We don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. We want to return to the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh. Um, your money isn't going to save you. I don't care how many stacks and zeros you got. It ain't going to save you. Um, the most high Yahweh will take all of your money. Um, he will take your card, your bank account, whatever you want to do, because he is Yahweh. He is the King, the Holy One of this world. So I uh, pray for me as I pray for the nation, as I pray for the Lord, and Yahweh, as I pray for all of our sons and daughters to wake up and return. Um, no one's coming to pick you up and take you out of the United States of America. You got to do the work. People have been leaving America since the 60s, um, Hebrews. Um, so it's no excuse. Yahweh's been giving us stimulus checks and all type of money and funding for us to get out of the United States and leave. And he says that he sends his servants from the rising of the sun to the going down thereof. So I'm praying um, that you all get out of the United States of America and focus on Yahweh and not focus on what people say, what men say, what children say. You gotta focus on the Creator, okay? Uh, Yahweh is right in the holy. Yahweh will be glorified with or without me, you or any, or any of us. Yeah, we gotta return to Yahweh um, completely 100. Those classes are distractions. Um, whoredom is going on, all manner of wickedness. Um, you need to get somewhere by yourself and meditate and think on, be think yourselves. Think about your wickedness. All of that, they're jumping around in the class and people rolling their eyes and having attitudes and it's always an issue. You might want to come out of those classes, Israel. And you might want to get ready and be prepared to meet your baby. Um, Yahweh is to be feared. This is the Reed Sea right there. And across from there, there are mountains over there in Saudi Arabia. And our 
home. Jerusalem is right down that way, and we don't go anywhere um, until those people are white Belfar land, and we know there's war coming, there's rumors of wars. Uh, but we got to obey Yahweh, okay? That, that's just all it is to it. You got to obey the mighty Yah. I'm sitting here on the mountain up high, and I'm looking all around me. And I'm looking at things, I'm watching things, I'm hearing things, a lot of evilness in America. My children and my grandchildren and all to be blessed abundantly and come on out. This is where Yahweh is at me this morning. Um, it is uh, 8.33. I've been out since about uh, 6.05 no, praying for the nation. Yeah, I've been out here since 5-ish praying for the nation. I'm uh, sending up prayers and supplication during the morning sunrise on Instagram. They're messing with my YouTube. They're messing with my Facebook because they know that their time is up. So um, this is a plea for help. This is a plea to the creator. It ain't about me at all. It ain't about what I look like, what I got, what I don't got, because Yahweh going to bless me anyway. Um, I just want to find favor in his eyes by being pleasing to the Most High Yah, not pleasing the people. That ain't it. So again, we're here in South Sun. Barbados, Trinidad, Tobago, St. Lucia, uh, St. Martin, you can go to Guyana, or you can go to Africa, Ghana, um, Tanzania, Nigeria, um, Kenya, uh, now where I am, anywhere um, to get away from that captivity. So uh, if you want to come here, just inbox me, I'll show you the way, I'll help you um, as much as I can. And once again, I'm a widow with a child, so if a widow, if one child can do it, um, you surely can get out of the United States of America. Um, in fact, I'm going back to the as you said, to flee. In Jeremiah 51, read all of it. Read Isaiah 13. Your homes are going to be desolate. Animals are going to live in them. Um, if you're comfortable, you're probably in a bad situation. You're not supposed to be comfortable right about now. You're supposed to be fleeing, packing up your bags, getting your passports, and getting out of Babylon, as Most High Yah said. So I have a great combination. I come from the good of spirit, then I'll get back in the water, and then I'm going home. So this has been a real spiritual time, uh, real spiritual with the Most High Yah. Um, Yahweh is righteous, Yahweh is holy, and Yahweh will be glorified. Um, I don't know what y'all waiting on, but I pray that y'all get out of the way of America before it's too late, before the gates are open. And it ain't even going to be able to go anywhere. You're really going to work with Yahweh. He's going to say, Why didn't you go when I sent my servants, the prophets, from the rising of the sun? And I've been out from the rising of the sun until the going down thereof, and you did not leave. You said you wanted to wait on when you was ready to go. You said you were ready to get this, that, and third. Y'all ain't going to hear that, okay? But I pray that he's merciful to all of us. But you got to flee out of America. And those who are coming up against this word, um, I pray that you all change your hearts uh, before Yahweh destroy you, okay? Um, Yahweh's to be feared. He's not playing with any of us. He didn't say think about leaving if you wanted to leave. He's, he commanded us to go uh, before his wrath comes upon the United States of America. And you don't want to be caught up in the sin and the iniquity of that country. Okay, so I'm praying for you all. Pray my strength in Yah once again. I'm going to pick up and I'm headed down. Um, and I'm going back into the water. This is my spiritual time with Yahweh. YouTube, Leah Yehuda Israel. Um, that's with an apostrophe, L E apostrophe A H Yehuda Israel. Or you can go to my Facebook, so W S Saracho, uh, Leah Yehuda Israel. 